Well, the next match was the long-awaited grudge match between Diamante, who used to be somehow affiliated with Santana and Ortiz, right? No. Didn't she, or wasn't she in some type of... She was in a tag team with Eva Lise, I believe. I thought Diamante used to be with the a Puerto Rican men's group. Maybe I'm thinking of someone else. Maybe I'm just wrong. And speaking of where, where's Santana and Ortiz? Well, Santana was injured in that War Games match or the uh, Blood and Guts match. My God, that's been months ago. Ortiz, I don't think it was even that long ago, actually. Ortiz is still wrestling on these shows. I, I believe he was actually on the taping. I don't know if he was on, I guess he wasn't on Rampage. He was on the Grand Slam show. I heard he got a good pop because he's a hometown guy. But the other story is that apparently there's real life issues between the two of them, so they may not team together again. <laughs> Nobody likes anybody around there. Anyway, Diamante versus Jane Cargill. And Jane had her baddies, and Diamante had Trina. Remember, we, she came out with Trina on the show Wednesday and said, well, I got my bad bitch with me. You know, it used to be when you called women bitches, they got kind of upset. They didn't like it, but all these women refer to themselves as bitches. So is it okay now to call them bitches because they do it to themselves? Nope, that's not how it works. They're allowed to call themselves bitches, but you're not allowed to call them bitches. Why not? Because that's not the way the rules work. Who made the rules? The people who you are addressing are the ones who make the rules about how you're going to address them without offending them. So Trina was in the corner of Diamante, but she didn't rap. Now, she is a rapper, right? She is. I don't know what she currently does. I mean, she was kind of... I mean, she wasn't ever a really big rapper, but her scene or her day was kind of a little while ago. But I Does don't know Trina she... have a last name? Oh, she does in reality. I don't know what it is, but she was known... In the world of hip-hop, is just Trina. As just Trina. Well, at least this rapper didn't rap on the way to the ring. She just wandered out with the same expression. It looked like that she was possibly doing this for a payoff because a member of her family's been kidnapped, and she was suddenly in need for money. She didn't enjoy anything. She looked like she was completely confused by the whole situation, as we all were. <laughs> and... <laughs> And then even this match, even in fast forward, this was awkward as fuck. And at basically the finish was Diamante dives off the top, cross bodying Jane Cargill on the floor. Jane's supposed to catch her, but Jane almost went backwards over the rail into the front row. <laughs> the rail saved her and caught her and then boom and rolled her in the ring and hit her finish one, two, three. And then you've got the baddies. And But you've also, Trina gets in the ring to try to back Diamante up against Jane and the baddies. And then Trina <laughs> snatches Diamante up by the hair and slaps her in the face with a fake slap. And of course, Jim Ross, who actually has been cited now, he was on this program, Jim Ross goes, oh, Trina. Because he was about ready to fucking get out of there, as we all were. And Trina shook hands with Jane with a look on her face that looked like she'd rather be at the dentist having a root canal procedure. And that was that. So apparently Diamante's a bad friend or bad judge of character. And Trina, <laughs> she started out a baby face, but now she's a heel. My God, how will her career survive? And who really was the baddest bitch out of all of this? Because that's what they were fighting about, and I don't know that we ever determined. I don't think we determined anything. You're right about the lack of enthusiasm from Trina from the moment she walked out. <laughs> it's like she was sleepwalking to the ring. I don't know what the point of this is, because again, she, I believe, would be from the New York Tri-State area. I can't imagine they're taking Trina on the road to any more dynamites or anything, so this was just a one-time turn for no reason on Diamante, who we haven't seen on TV since she was teaming with Ivelisse, who they let go of a couple of years ago. This is the AEW women's division, folks. 
All elite women. Who is the baddest bitch? I think it's Jade. Jade's kind of running stuff there. She's kind of head of the bloodline. She's head of the table. And I still, I'm still convinced that now you're allowed to call ladies that word because they're all fighting over to see who's the biggest one and the baddest one. Well, they certainly like to call themselves it. That's for sure. 